Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can enable iCloud Photos to reduce the memory storage space on your iPhone 12 or the iPhone 12 Pro. First, let's go back to your home screen by uh, swiping up at the bottom of the screen. Then we're going to tap on Settings. In Settings, tap on General, and then go down and tap on iPhone Storage. And then in here, tap on Enable in the iCloud Photo section and then tap on enable iCloud photos and here so here can't enable iCloud photos you can try again and see more options in photos in settings so I'm just going to dismiss that so we can go back in photos in settings so we go down to photos and then we've got iCloud photos in here which you can tap on it to switch it on and so here one photo will be removed so I'm just going to remove one photo and the reason why we can't up, um, we can't switch it on is because um, iCloud storage only gives you a maximum of 15 gigabyte of free space for your iCloud account, and because the photos is already uh, over the over that limit of 16.32 uh, gigabyte, and that's why we are unable to uh, turn it on. Now, if you want to use the iCloud photos, you need to have uh, more space. You can purchase. Uh, more space or delete some of the videos or photos that you don't need and after that you should be able to uh, upload or turn on uh, iCloud photos so if I go back into here and if I go to uh, general so in general if I go into iPhone storage and if I go into photos down here I can delete uh, some photos so I'm going to review personal videos and say I want to delete this one. I don't really need that one. And so that should be able to give me uh, some more storage. So let's uh, check it out to see how much I've got now. So I still uh, don't have enough. So actually it's only 15.13. You can only have 1.34 gigabytes of iCloud storage available so I need a lot more uh, than that so you can see uh, that can be uh, something that can cause you not being able to turn on but yeah otherwise just get more space uh, for your iCloud uh, storage and then you should be able to upload your photos uh, into the cloud thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more videos